for the firm. This is what I told you. This is the guide for acting as well. Let's look for the horse. There's a falcon. Yep. The circle. And this is a horse. This is a two crown. Uh, so this is a god horse. This is not horse. Horse. Right. It's a god horse. Yes. They are protected and they give the fur. And this is a god amor. So look here. This is the way to go into Luxor Temple. Oh, okay. If you, but the government they close them there. But when you go to Luxor Temple, so we can walk in this way. Uh, but for me, we can't walk. Oh, uh, okay. But if you want to walk, I can give you the <laughs> ticket of Luxor Temple, and then we will we'll no, see that. We'll catch the ride with you. Look for the statues here. <laughs> The big studies. Wow. Oh my goodness. Wow. Wow. For the Queen Hatchip suit. This is without head. The head now in the British Museum. Oh wow. The head of these statues in the British Museum. And who was that? That was Hatshepsut? Um, Hatshepsut. Um, Hatshepsut. Um, yeah. This one. The famous lady. Okay. The famous and the biggest and the strong lady. Hatshepsut. Hatshepsut. Yeah. This is her? Yeah. Hatshepsut. I like Hatshepsut. Yeah, she's my favorite. Wow. Ski TV, this is... Yeah. But her steps on this is crazy. Steps, and this was... Yeah. So he was telling us this is Imhotep. If you don't know who Imhotep is, uh, anybody in the medical field, if you know the medical symbol with the snakes and, and the staff, that's that's Imhotep symbol. He was very advanced in uh, everything from the, the uh, stones like building to, to medicine. And uh, he's just a, a very, very prevalent figure in Egyptian, in ancient Egyptian uh, times. Imhotep. Just remember that name. But this is amazing, y'all. Just to see this in person, like I keep saying it, I keep saying the word amazing, but there's no other way to describe some of these places that we've been. Like they're truly amazing. And this one is truly amazing, truly breathtaking. And it's something you should definitely see for yourself. Cause the videos are good, but they they don't do this place justice. The feeling you get when you're here just, it's different, man, it's different. My bad, Chad. Wait, is this different from the other one? I think, is this where we were at before? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, but this is in the behind. This ah, is behind it. Look for that. Look for the Pharaoh. This is the Pharaoh, okay? The Pharaoh, he stayed between the two gods. The two gods, they are washing him. They are purifying him. Ah. They are cleaning him. Okay. But here, the cleaning is not by water. The cleaning here is by ank and by was. Look. Oh look. And this is it's not only cleaning him, that's giving him a healthy life and long life and a blessing life. So it's so it's really not a physical cleanse, it's more of a spiritual cleanse. Yes. Got you. But here's it's by ang and by one. Two symbols of life. Wow. Look for them. Here is a pharaoh in the front. Oh wow. His life he gives over to the sea god, the god Ammon and his wife and his son Kutsu. And upstairs with the colors, with the amazing colors here. Oh we my! We can see two ladies. This is a, this is Wagit and Nikhbet. Wagit, Wagit and, and Nikhbet. Nikhbet. The two ladies for our employer, the two goddess for our employer here. Wow! And he gives the pharaoh the two crowns, white and red. Look, white, this one and red. Okay. So he's the king for our employer here. Wow! This is some coronation. Okay. Coronation. Yeah. They give the pharaoh who is the two crown, Abar and Loya. So the two ladies walk it and with the two crown for Abar and Loya. Wow. Okay. So this is where we are in the behind. You want to go there the first? Oh, it's okay. It's all right. Yeah, it's okay. Yeah, these three. are actually better than those ones. I got two guys. Yes, sir. Wow. This is it. Look for this one. This is the goddess. 
give a line. Oh, she's new. We didn't we didn't learn about yeah. her. Who's that? This is a goddess Sigmet. 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 Yeah, we say here Sigmet. Sigmet. We say here. And what she? Sigmet. Yeah. It's hard. Yeah, it's hard for me. <laughs> it's hard for me. So Sigmet, she's a goddess of war. Goddess of war. Yes, she's a goddess for all the pharaohs. They are scared from this. Goddess. Oh, okay. Ah, I like yeah. her. Too. <laughs> this is the goddess Sekhmet, the goddess of war. Sekhmet. This is she takes the order from the god Amurak to kill anybody. If she oh, wants. okay. That's like his hitman. Yeah, she have also and her his wife, her wife mm -hmm. and her husband. What his name? Bitah. Bitah. He's the god of Memphis. Oh, okay. So he was the original a god of the original capital yeah, city. Memphis. Ah. Oh. This is his wife. Okay. He have a temple here. It's called Bitah Temple. We go there. Okay. okay? Yeah. We go there, but it's a, it's a closed temple. It's a small, but I will I will open it. Maybe it's I if they wait for this. And she take this and put it for her son. That's for he live there. Wow. That's crazy. Yeah. She's a woman. She's clever. Yeah. She came with me till here. She asked me about this one. Oh my goodness. Yes, she put that there in her son. And after this is. She she do it like this, and it here, and here. Wow, yes. this is amazing. So this is a sacred, this is a sacred tree, an ancient tree, and these little things contain milk. And so he was saying a woman had asked him about that, and uh, she had put the milk. Well, I guess her son had something on his neck, and she had put it on his neck, and it actually healed his neck. So that's crazy. That's crazy. Look at all this, y'all. Yeah, wow. This is the goddess Sigmeta. Sigmeta. Wow. Oh my God. Come here to take a picture. Give her a picture. That's amazing. That's amazing. Yeah. Take a picture. You want to take a picture? Yeah, no, I got one. I'm gonna get one. I got one as well. I'm gonna get one. I got some video too. Wow. Yeah, that's amazing. Suck my thighs. This is a beta. It's not saying this one, this one, this one. I mean this one. I go this is oh, okay. Wow. That's amazing. That's how he was saying it's sacred. Not many people can visit. Because here it is forbidden, not allowed to go. Right. right. This is a small temple, but it's the temple is damaged for the god Bitah. The god uh. And this is actually what we just saw on Ski TV. I just wanted to let y'all know. Because I know a lot of these names I won't remember. But that is where we were at. And so he said it is uh, blocked off to people. I'm sure the tour guys are allowed to go in though, because they're they're probably uh like tapped in with the people back there. But uh yeah. That was pretty cool. Karnak is very nice. Definitely a nice, nice temple. Amazing, I would say. This is just... I can't wait to watch this footage, man. That's all I'm gonna say. This is the chamber, the red chamber for hot shit soup. Hot shit soup. So just remember that. It was a woman pharaoh, and her story is amazing. So do your research on Hatshepsut. soup. Fatal ending, but she's a great pharaoh. They they respect her out here. They respect her a lot. So, Ski TV. I'm recording so much for y'all. I just want to get this. This is the open air museum in Luxor at Karnak Temple. And just to sit, look like just look at the detail of this. And I would assume this is alabaster, just based off how it feels and looks. But just, I know I keep saying it, but it truly is breathtaking. 
It truly is. Just want to let y'all know, man. Go see the world. Go see the world. Don't be afraid. You know, because uh, a lot of people... With you they're cool. Yeah, I guess. Don't be afraid, though. You know, I know people try to make it seem like, ah, oh, it's not safe here. It's not safe there. But it's been safe in Egypt. Egypt has been safe. And everybody that we talk to, like even the tour guides, will tell us Egypt is always safe. You know? So... The crazy thing is, though, if you look on, because I don't know about y'all, I travel a lot. So when I before I go to a country, I always check out the U.S. Embassy, tra check the re travel restrictions. I guess Egypt has actually been in uh, reconsidered travel, like the uh, orange zone, for I think they want. I think they want to. I think it was like eleven years, but it's probably more now. Yeah. But uh, flies. it's worth it. It's worth it, y'all. Do yeah, it. You want to know it's not worth it? These fucking flies. Yeah, the flies, flies is everywhere. Are, they like stick to your skin. They on your face, everything. Them motherfuckers are just snoring.